Yo, what's up guys? So today I'm going to be showing you the new uh, Cube Core server on Azeroth, and you know, it's coming soon. Um, it'll be there with the full release, so it's actually open beta right now, so you can join and play. But it's at Azeroth.cc. But anyway, let's get in Cube Core. So this is going to be taking the place of Kitmap, because Kitmap's kind of kind of dead. Um, it was whatever, so based on the classic code game mode, uh, we made a custom server that's basically the same thing as the original. So, let's take a look around. Actually, this is also one of the Koei spawns from Cube Core, so, yeah, pretty neat. So, let's look over here. This is a kit creator station, um, and this is how you would make a kit and to play. So, as you can see, I have no items, and there's no, like, default kits like Diamond or PvP or Bard or anything. So for picking your kit, you're going to want to go ahead and grab whatever you want. So let's get some armor, let's go PvP armor. By, by the way, when you click the diamond here, it automatically sets it. So you, it doesn't appear that I have armor bars right here. But if you leave, you actually do have it. It's really fine. And if you click on these, you won't get the item. It'll just, you know, spawn in your inventory. But if you, like, click these, let's just go there. That's about them. Yeah, this is supposed over here, by the way. So what you're gonna do, you know, just get like a sword, I guess some shit, um, maybe some building blocks, perhaps. I'm not actually gonna grab any building blocks. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, we're just gonna make our kit here, I guess. That work. And we're gonna get some debuffs. And then some speeds. And then let's get some pots. So now one thing on this network that is different from most cube core servers is that when you save your kits, you can't just do it in this menu. There isn't like a thing. So what you have to do is you have to do kit save and then we're gonna do debuff for this. So when you open up here, it'll show debuff again. And once you've created a kit, you can use left click to actually apply this kit right click to save over it and middle click to delete the kit so that's that's pretty much that and um, by the way this disposal you can't drop items in spawn so say you were to like use your speed you then would have to put in a disposal to get rid of it or just go out of spawn and do that now the next thing is renaming your items basically every beacon in spawn will allow you to simply right click it with any item and it'll pick a random name from a list that, you know, it's been created. You can add more, you can, you can tell us more names to put in, in the CSNs of the Discord server. But basically you just right click it and it gives you a random name. Let's, let's go with this, I guess. So Crystalware, mm -hmm. pretty sick. So that's our sword name. And that's pretty much how that works. So then you can go ahead and go out and PvP. Uh, I also want to show two more things that we're making soon. So, first is the shop, which is going to come soon. It'll have stuff like gapples and um, other other crap like that. But you won't be able to put it. So the thing is, with the items you buy at the store or at the shop over there, you can't actually put that in a kit. It will block you and take them out, or just block you if you don't have them at all. So that's that's that. And then this over here is a staff hosted Fimble, which is currently closed because we're not hosting it yet right now. But basically when this is hosted, you'll be able to just go down there and enter the Fimble event that we'll have. And that's pretty much that. Um, so next thing, I'm actually going to need some blocks for this, but let's go use them. So I'm going to grab this. Basically, we've... Um, with Cube 4, when you place blocks, you can't place them in this stone area here, this is just for PvP, but past this bedrock area you can place whatever blocks you want, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. And usually on servers like this they reset it like a couple days, uh, or like every day they will restart the server and they'll just reset the map, but on here it's not going to. So that at the end of the season of Cube Court, you can always just look over here and see what was created through the help of you know, all the people. It's pretty sick. And yeah, that's pretty much that. Um, there's really much more to it. 
But another thing is, you can actually combat attack yourself. It's not, it's not a bug. You can combat attack yourself like that. And then you won't be able to walk in here. You can't enter spawn with combat attack. So we don't like have a wall or anything. It's just, you know, it doesn't like it. That's pretty much that. You also can't pearl into spawn unless you have no combat tag. In which case you can. Ah, uh, fuck. I fucked myself. Damn it. But anyway, this, this is a bug we'll have to fix. Oh well. It's your fault for doing that. But anyway, that, that's pretty much all there is to do with Cubecore. And, and you know, this is a new server that we're introducing. It's currently in open beta. You can join now and play it. Um, along with the rest of the network right now. So, say you want to go and like practice KPP or Cubecore, you can just join any of those. Which is kind of broken right now. Uh, and that's pretty much it. So if you guys are interested in playing or joining the network, then the IP will be in the description. It's also just azraf.cc, which you can find anywhere here. Uh, if you're interested in joining the Discord, that will be in the description though. Uh, I believe it's discord.azraf.cc along with that. And also, ignore the icon here. This is from before the name changed back to Azraf, so it'll still be there. We haven't changed the icon on the server list yet, but we're still in progress of that. And yeah, I guess that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys are interested in playing on here, as I said, or to join, or as I said already, go ahead and join, and then you just join the cube core, and then that's, that's pretty much it. Um, yeah. So, I mean, if you're interested, go ahead and do that. It's pretty simple to try. We don't have, like, cough or anything yet, but we're going to be adding that later in the later when the actual um, first season starts, so you can actually use it, when, or do those events when it comes out, and that'll be that, so see you guys later, in my next video maybe, and yeah, that, bye.